वेलकम यू ऑल इन आवर सेकेंड लेक्चर गाइज दिस इज आवर न्यू यूट्यूब चैनल नेम इज यू नो कोडिंग स्कूल इन दिस चैनल वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न जावा स्क्रिप्ट फ्रॉम बिगनर लेवल टू एडवांस लेवल ऑल्सो वी सॉल्व ऑल डी एस ए टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन वट वी हैव इन जावा स्क्रिप्ट यू कैन एज्यूम डेट इन जावा स्क्रिप्ट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न एरेज टू डायमेंशनल एरेज लूप functions object object method recursion trees linked list sorting bubble and all those things so in this lecture this lecture is based on what we need to install any app this time we guys we have to install any app in our system for uh, javascript but we are now in very beginner state beginning state okay we don't need to install any app this time we can easily run our program through website also so in which website we are going to learn everything in javascript uh, so you have to follow me so here we have are going to write here replit.com you guys also have to go in replit.com so we enter this so first few days we are going to solve only problems not create any website so uh, for solve, uh, solving problem problems we do, uh, guys don't need any web uh, app just like you can say that vs code is uh, for javascript to run our program but this time we don't need any website uh, app so in replit.com you can see here after you creating your account you have to just uh, write uh, your email and uh, your password password can different from your mail id also so after this you uh, you have a mail for verification and uh, you you can easily go in your gmail account and you can verify your account from there so after you uh, creating this you can see here this is wait for a minute you can see here create option so in create option you can create your own file you you can see that here i have created my file name is variable dimensional array multi dimensional array functions we, uh, more more type of file we have we can easily access from here see all replets but you, know, you guys are new new in this so you have to create from here your own file so here you see a create a replet account in template we have python node c but we are going to solve we are going to create our file in which node node.js so you have to click here node.js this is for javascript so after this you clicking in node.js you are going to in title area in title area you have to write any file name so we are going to write here that lecture wait for a second so we are going to write here lecture 2 okay so now in create rep uh, you, you can see here repl which is replet so we are going to create a replet so now we have our main page uh, which I have created in replet.com. So you can see here also my mail ID and here you can see that lecture 2 uh, what I have created here that rep lecture 2. So in this option uh, now we are going to tell you about what is this page where you are going to write any code where, where from where you are going to run any code from where you can do everything so there you can see that index.js when you creating any file you have a this you have index.js you can if this is a 
very basic file when you are creating any account when you are creating any account in replay.com you have a index.js file so from index.js file you have to write your code in this area you can see here not sure what to do run some example start typing to dismiss so you have to write your code here and you can see that this is a run option from here you can see your output what you have write in your code so what we are going to write in our code in this area in this area what we are going to write here we can see the output from here okay guys from in this console area console area we can see my output of running of our code you know guys in replay.com we love uh, do any uh, solve of uh, any problem i love to program in replay.com so here you can see that index.js in uh, any node.js you have a fixed file name is index.js you can create a multiple file here you can see here that i am creating that problem one.js you have to write your file name first and then you have to write dot js because we are creating our file in uh, we are creating our program also in dot js means dot js means what javascript so we can create multiple of files here problem 2 dot js problem 3 dot js you can create your own uh, you can write here anything what you want you can write here assignment 1.js assignment.js assignment 2.js you can just you have to do you can create anything here okay guys so so this is our run option this is our console area this is our cell area what is the uh, benefit of this what is for console what is for sale what is for run so in index.js this run option is only for index.js you can see here that not sure what to do run some examples this is only for uh, you can run some examples here you can see uh, say that you have to uh, you don't need to know about what is this but but i have going to write here that You, you don't need to guys understand what I am going to write here. It's just uh, this is index.js file and this is for only run some examples. If you have some examples, you can easily run here. You can run here and you can see, uh, see that this is our printing statement. Okay, guys, this is our printing statement in JavaScript. We can write console.log, small bracket on and under apostrophe, we are using a string value hello world so you can see here that our output is what hello world so this is for only index.js area if you are going to write any programs in problem 1.js you can assume that this is our program what i have right here and i am going to cut this and print in this area so in in index.js here you can see that nothing i have so when we are going to run this, this didn't give me any output. This didn't give me any output. So for problem one, where we can go and run our program. So in prob uh, for problem two also, where we can go and run our program. So you can see here that I am going to copy this. And in problem two, we are going to paste it. Okay, guys. And here, I am using welcome. So in problem one, we have a console log statement, which is tell me that hello world. This gives me the output of hello world. And in problem two, we have a welcome area. So in printing a statement, there is a welcome. So output is what welcome in this hello world so we uh, we have to run this program how we can do 
so easily you can see here this is a cell area you can see that this is a cell area this is a cell area for console this run option gives me the output in console but in cell area what we have created any file in our uh, you can see here lecture 2 we have created multiple of file problem 1 problem 2 you can um, create multiple of file here so for this what we have creating what we are you are going to create index.html is fixed but what we have created problem 1 problem 2 problem 3 and problem 4 so for this you have to run your code from where you can easily go and uh, run your code so simple trick is this you have to go in cell area and here you can write the fixed is node the fixed thing is what node so this node is fixed and you have to write space here from your keyboard also you can uh, after node you can write space and after this you can write your uh, this area problem one dot js what you are creating your file name gives here you have to give here okay guys so i am going to write here node problem one dot js you can see here problem one dot js is what is our file name so from this uh, now you have to press enter from your keyboard i am going to press my enter key and you can see here hello world this is what hello world but when you are going to run this option you can see here in run option there is nothing because in index.js file we are not going to create any code we are not going to write any code here so the run option in console area didn't give me any output so you can see here in cell area we have output of hello world so in cell area also you can see here lecture 2 lecture 2 is what lecture 2 is our fixed file name what we have created at the time of replet okay now you can write here node problem 2.js you can see here oh sorry node problem 2.js sorry see here what is this welcome in problem 2 we have writing a statement or printing statement is what welcome so we have welcome you uh, what you, you are going to create here you can go in cell area and write here that node problem one dot js okay guys you have a hello world so in problem one file name what we are creating our code please give me the output of hello world so here is hello world and in problem two what we are going to write here welcome so here is a welcome output so here you can see that delete option you can also delete here uh, so replay.com is very useful for you guys also you can create this web uh, file anywhere from any time and you can easily access this also uh, replay.com saves your file automatically when you are going to you can see here i am going to delete this okay we are going to close our tab of replay.com and if you are going to here replay.com you can see here i have a file name which is lecture 2 when I'm clicking here, you can see here that what we have right at that time problem one console.log hello world and problem two console.log welcome. This is as usual. What I have right at that time, this is here. Okay. So you can easily access in Replet and Replet autom automatically saves your all program at that time so if you are outside from your home and uh, in your mind you have uh, some issues that 
from which approach I have solved that type of problem. You can easily go on your reply.com and you can easily see that what we have write a code for that approach for that problem also. So you can easily access here. Okay, reply.com is good for this time. You know, this time you don't need to install any app. We are in beginner level. So you don't need any app for JavaScript and all those. You are easily, you can go easily in rapplet.com and uh, solve any issues here. Solve any problems also here. In cell area, You what you are creating your file, you can run your code from cell area and in, this is console area and this is for only index.js. Okay guys, now we are going to copy this and write here and we can You can see here I have right here sudo sync. Please give me the output of sudo sync. You can easily go here and run this, and you have the out of output of sudo sync. But from this run area and this console area, you cannot take a output of problem one js problem two dot js. From cell area, you can easily access this 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 all what you have created here. So that's our main motive to understand you that we know not not a need any install app at this time. Okay, guys. So you have learned here to simply go to website to run your code. So in next lecture, we are going to start our journey in JavaScript from beginning level to advanced level in next lecture I will tell you what is variable and how JavaScript work. This time you don't need to understand what is this this is only a printing statement of javascript why i am right pseudo thing in under apostrophe double f apostrophe okay guys so you don't need to understand here please like share and subscribe our channel thank you